Welcome back to the Morning Wrap. Joining me right now, we have Mark Liu and our newest meteorologist, Marina Jurica, who's in for Paul. Yeah, how are you? Good, how are we're you? Sucks. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so she's, she's like, oh. so I had to convince her to do this segment because you're the newest member of our weather team here mm -hmm. on KCAL. We're so fascinated by you, at least I am. I think you're so cool. You're so amazing. You've done so many really incredible things in your past. I don't know how we got you. So <laughs> so I want everyone to know more about you because I feel like we didn't get the proper introduction when you first started, blah, 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 blah. So now we're here, okay? Um, so I want to start off with, and thank you, Mark, for joining me oh, in this whole conversation because I think you're really cool. Um, I want to start off with just a brief uh, background and also just can you tell me about this whole NASA thing that you did? Oh, <laughs> yeah. So, <laughs> just like NASA uh, So I started launch forecasting when I was working at the ABC station in Orlando, Florida for Kennedy Space Center. And I've always loved it and always been very fascinated with launch forecasting. But when I graduated from UCLA with atmospheric science degree, unfortunately, the space shuttle program was ending. So they didn't need a lot of launch forecasters. So that's when I started broadcasting. So I broadcasted it for 20 years over multitude of markets all over the country with crazy weather and then, I like how you just brush over NASA like can you tell me the difference between that type of forecasting and what you do here it's vastly different okay. so so basically uh, the rocket only cares about what's happening in the upper levels of the atmosphere mm -hmm. so fog let's say at Vandenberg uh, if you're tracking fog it leaves the fog within a millisecond hmm. and really it's the upper level winds that could veer it or get it off its trajectory and so what we look at with forecasting for a rocket is what's happening way up high in the atmosphere versus what's happening down here we as earthlings only care about what's happening down here on the ground so it is completely different forecasting but it's pretty cool either way you're so cool we're gonna have to have you back on so we can talk more about this because we we also know that you just as a human being you are so fascinating in general so we wanted to play this other game with you for okay. everyone to get to know because it's nice to know like different sides of people right <laughs> so this is called get to know me okay here's how it works you're gonna ask us a question Question's gonna pop up. We're gonna try to guess the correct answer by choosing from the multiple choice. <laughs> um, you obviously know the answer. We do not. So mm -hmm. we're gonna have you start off. Okay. That's the first question. All right. What UCLA sports do I have season tickets to? Soccer, basketball. No, oh, soccer, soccer and, and basketball. basketball. Football and basketball, or gymnastics and football. I feel like because you, you. Well, I don't know. I, you know what? <laughs> I'm gonna go with soccer. Uh, wait, no, no, you no, wait. Oh, I'm going to go because we're both Bruins. I just found out. Oh, <clears throat> yep. right here. I'm a uh, huge yep. Bruin. Okay, wait, I'm changing my mind. I'm going with football. I was, <laughs> was going to go with football and basketball, those two. You got it. Yep. You got it. My dad both went Bruins. there as well, and we're huge wow, Bruin fans. Right. Yeah. So, uh, so, yeah, I, I, I love it. Okay, well, I lost. Next okay. question. <laughs> okay, <laughs> what is my favorite sport to watch? Is this different? Is this okay. different? I'm just going to change it. Let's do basketball. What do you think? I think football. I mean, I feel like you would be right, but I wanted to be different. What is it? Uh, well, it's actually to watch basketball. Uh, oh, uh, I got uh, one. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but I love hockey too. Yep. Okay, what's the next question? All right, where did my family immigrate from? Hmm. Italy, C. Greece, or Croatia? C. I'm going to go with C also. Yes. Because yes. I, right. I asked you this you question. You already oh, asked. You I already knew. I already knew. You yes. Knew. Both my parents are from Croatia, and I'd love to go visit them every summer, and uh, it's really beautiful. Yes. How you really say my last name is Yurica, mm -hmm. but nobody yep. ever really gets I'm gonna that I'm going to try right. that. So I say Jurica. Yeah. I'm going to try it. Mm -hmm. Also, aren't you an opera singer and a figure skater? I know what? we don't have time yes. for this, but I had to throw it out there. I know. So next time she comes on, <laughs> we're going to talk about this. I know. This is crazy. She's she's things. incredible. Okay, don't <laughs> wow. go away. Luckily, she works here, so we can bother her with all these things in the future. You every day <laughs> don't go away. Our pet of the week is here, and that's not all. We have singer Nita also here. I hear the warming up over there, so stick with us. We'll be right back.